I hope everybody's summer is going well. And what I'm going to show you today is these little $5 disposable fly traps that I picked up. And I've got about 10 days of use, and I'll show you how many flies and maggots these things picked up. So they got these on Amazon, and I'll post a link where you can get these in the description below. But they're really stupid easy to get going. So all you have to do is on the top here, that little green thing there pulls out, but you got to take some scissors and cut a, right where that shows where you need to cut it out, and that little thing pulls up, then you fill it up with water. And in about two days, it'll really start stinking like rotting freaking meat. I actually had these on my patio, and I couldn't stand the smell, so I put them out over there. I also picked up four of these little fly trap sticky sticks and hung them up high here. And these are actually doing pretty well. You actually have to bait these traps with this blue granules that comes with these things. I got these at Tractor Supply. And they're actually doing pretty darn good. But not as good as those disposable fly traps. And I'll show you a close up here in a second what I'm talking about. So let's go over here and I'll show you what's going on. It's almost like these things are just, I don't know how to describe it, too good at catching flies. I, I don't know. This thing is almost completely filled up with flies and maggots and some other creepy crawly bugs in there that, has, that they've caught. But it literally smells like rotting meat. And I remember when I was deployed to uh, Baghdad and we threw a lot of stuff in the burn pits and, you know, dead animals and stuff. And uh, it kind of smelled like the same. It's just the, the most god ugly, oh, just disgusting freaking smell. So, yeah, these things definitely work if you got fly problems, but they also attract a lot of bugs too. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching and hopefully this video helps you out and take care.